Bring back what you've been missing Bring back Cash Valley Hearing and Audiology At Cash Valley Hearing and Audiology, we believe in a very thorough hearing test. We invited a camera today to follow us through a hearing test. We have Tad here. Let's follow him as he has his hearing checked. Tad, what brings you in to see us today? Uh, my wife made me. <laughs> How long have you noticed you haven't been hearing very well? Uh, several years ago. Tell me a little bit about your hearing loss. Did it happen all of a sudden or did it happen over time? I think it's been gradual. Do you feel that one ear is worse than the other? They're about the same. Describe your most difficult listening environment. Probably while I'm fishing and I hear the roar of the river behind me. <laughs> Have you ever had surgery to your ears? Do you hear ringing noises in your ears? Does any member of your family have hearing loss? Do you ever feel dizzy? Do you have frequent or severe headaches? Any allergies? Any numbness in your face or fingertips? Do loud sounds hurt your ears? Are you currently using any blood thinners, pain medications, diabetes medications, heart medications, or other medications? Luckily not. <laughs> have you ever been exposed to loud noise, gunfire, music, motorcycles, machinery, occupational noise, all the fun things? All of the above apply. Um, I've spent a lot of time around F-16s and we used to have to launch them so I was less than six feet from the engine while it was running. Um, shot a lot of bullets through guns. Um, yeah, I've probably lost some hearing from some of that. Were you in the military? And have you ever had your hearing tested before? No, I have not. Tad, the first thing I want to do is take a peek in your ear. That looks great, no wax. All landmarks are where they're supposed to be. Nice pink shiny eardrums. Okay, looks great. Okay, Dad, for this first test, is what I want to do is I want to test the physical parts of your ear. Make sure the eardrum and the ear bones behind the eardrum are moving correctly. So what we'll do is we'll put a little soft rubber tip in your ear, and I'm going to put a little bit of air pressure into your ear. You'll move your eardrum in and back out and tell us how that's working. You don't have to do anything but relax. I will put a little bit of slippery stuff on here because it does create need to create a, a seal so it'll feel a little wet. <laughs> I like you're getting a wet willy. Okay. <laughs> but you don't have to do anything but relax. Okay, Tad, we're going to put these earphones in your ears. Okay. So what I'm going to do is give you that button to push. Okay. We'll put these in your ears. I'm going to play some beeps to you. When you hear the beeps, I want you to push the button. Okay. Now the beeps will get very soft. So if you think you hear them, go ahead and push it. Okay. Now we're trying to find the very softest sounds that you can hear. So there'll be some other tests as we go along. Some speech tests. There's a microphone here that will pick up your voice, and I can hear you on the other side. And I talk back through the headphones. Okay. I'll just kind of explain as we go along. All right. Okay, Dad, can you hear me okay? Is this a comfortable level? Okay. We'll start with your right ear first. Just push the button when you hear the beep.
Say the word ice cream. Ice cream. Say the word mouse trap. Mouse trap. Say the word baseball. Baseball. Say the word airplane. Airplane. Mailman. Cowboy. Railroad. Toothbrush. Hot dog. Say the word mouse trap. Say the word popcorn. Say the word mailman. Say the word shoelace. Say the word. Well, Tad, how do you think you did? Mixed emotions, but I. It also told us if you had a hole in your eardrum, which you did not, for that matter, and you were still able to hear that. There's actually a threshold in your ear, a reflex in your ear. We measure that. Your range is eight kilohertz to one the rest of the. Okay. So, so this graph is. Bring back what you've been missing. Bring back cash back.